So you might be in a situation where for some reason, every time you go through and try to get access to a certain Wi-Fi, you might see that you keep getting this thing that tells you Wi-Fi access is denied. Now, this can happen for a few different reasons. The number one thing you wanna just make sure is that the particular Wi-Fi connection that you're trying to connect to, you may just wanna make sure there's not a problem with that Wi-Fi. You may wanna make sure that you typed in the password correctly, everything like that across the board correctly, because if you didn't, well, that's pretty much going to be the number one issue that you're going to run into. This in and of itself, every time I run into an issue, it's usually because that Wi-Fi connection didn't give me the right connection and you know, permission and everything like that to give me access to it. So that's the first thing. Another thing is that sometimes if you're going through and if you're actually typing in a certain Wi-Fi address or if you're going through and connecting to a Wi-Fi, you may once again just make sure, you, may, you might just want to go ahead and just make sure that within that particular Wi-Fi connection that you're trying to connect to once again, you may have to go and get permission and you may actually have to go through and actually do a sign in. If you're connecting to like a college Wi-Fi connection or if you're connecting to like some sort of business connection, you may actually have to have permissions to actually go ahead and actually get access to it. So double check that, contact your Wi-Fi administrator or whatever and get access to that. Now on top of that, if that's not working, you may want to go and make sure there's not like some sort of Wi-Fi connection problem. So what you can try doing is you can just go ahead and make your way over to your iPhone or Android, you know, or PC, Wi-Fi, you know, whatever, your software update panel. So make your way over to your settings here. Click into your general settings if you have and just find a way to update your particular device. A lot of the times all you're going to have to do is update your phone. And that's another thing you can do to fix this problem. Finally, if none of those things are working, you may want to try restarting your device or restarting your Wi-Fi router or contacting your Wi-Fi administrator. And that's another way to go ahead and basically fix this problem as well. So... Those are the main ways to go and fix it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything, also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.